everyone, and welcome back to Tales of Symphonia. I am Wishblade, and Lloyd is in his swimming outfit. I don't know why he's in his swimming outfit. Well, I do know, just because I felt like showing it off. Some of the others got some other costumes as well. This is what they're going to be. There you go. You'll you'll see eventually. And now, you shall go and explore Darius Carlon by going into a fight against phantasms, death itself. And Samuel something. Samuel? Samuel L. Jackson? I am missing some magic lenses. That's not a good thing. Hmm. I should do something about that. Oh no! But yeah. Around here, you'll find a various bunch of undead. They, A bunch of these guys, they really don't like the light. So rain is going to be very useful around here. But even so, we have all the power in the world. So we can easily take out these bastards. I haven't used them this yet, there you go. More light. Oh. It's strong against the physical attacks. That is so sad. Can you stop doing that, you silly son of a bitch? Hello, Spread. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, Spread, it's been a while since I've seen you. At least from what I can remember. Hello, Ray. I'm gonna go over here then. Since you're... Okay, fine, I'll go back. <laughs> Impossible. Kinda. Maybe it's a little bit impossible, but it's okay. Now, there is Carlon. This wee little area that we are in has additional gold and seven chests. One of them being right over here. And what is inside? There is XM level three. I do not care. And then there should be another one somewhere this way. This is gonna be a piece of oh dear! Doom Guards! And no, not the Doom Guards of World of Warcraft or Warcraft in general. These are just improved skeletons. There's nothing else to say about them. Ow! Stop it, you bastards. Fine, I'll go into Overlimited that if that's what it takes. Also Air Thrust. They do seem a bit di more difficult to kill than other things. And I totally forgot a certain something. I should show that off. Because I didn't do it in the last episode, and maybe it was kind of a little bit important because there was a new weapon. What new weapon was it? I'm sure you can remember. If you can't, then you will you will know soon enough. I'll do it once we get out of this battle. Ray? Oh, Ray didn't kill it. That is so sad. Lloyd, you need to remember that. I know the enemy's weakness. Light. Also, let's have a look at that thing. Um, I don't want to look at it like that. Why? Because I don't know why. There you go. Where is it? The Material Blade, a weapon composed of a blade of fire and a blade of ice. It looks very nice. Is it better? No, it is not. That is so sad. Well, it's better in thrust, but not in slash, and I primarily do use slash, but you know what? I don't care. Let's use the Material Blade, because it is fucking awesome. It is badass. And there's the other chest that I've been looking for, XM level 2. I really don't care about that. Hello. Uh-oh, it's a phantom knight. Oh no, it's not a death knight, but a phantom knight. It's even worse, but it shall die nonetheless. My goodness, it's resistant to all the things. Whatever shall we do about it? Oh no, just kick its ass. You know what? Here you go. Have this. And some things. That's actually also a thing. If you use three advanced spells like Grand Cross, Photon, and Explosion, the third one doesn't seem to want to be cast. Apparently, for some reason. At least that's what I've been able to tell from doing unison attacks that way. Apparently, you can only cast two advanced spells in a unison attack. So there you go. Now we also know that. Moving right along. Are there more enemies up ahead? I don't think so. Hey, we're back at the beginning. So, we shall move right along by going... Not that way, there's nothing over there. At least from what I know. I'm fairly certain there isn't. So, we'll go this way. And up here is a monster, and another monster, and a chest. And the chest contains... The Golden Helm. The best helmet in the game. A helmet once possessed by an ancient monarch. I'm sure there's a reference in there somewhere, but you know what? Here you go, Lloyd. Have some gold on your head. And you, ha! Huh? I'm not gonna fight you. Why? Because I don't- I don't wanna. 
I can't be bothered. I want to go find more treasure. Hello there. Yeah, this place... It's... Not really that long. It is kind of... Of a large area, but it's mostly comprised of just all these... Corridors, kinda. Could you call them corridors? I think you could. So yeah, we just have to follow these for... So and so long until we find everything that we need. Hello there, Angel. Do you have new enemies? Uh-oh! Dark Spear! And Dark Sword! Those are new, and I do not have enough magic lenses for them. Oh well, I'll use my last one. There you go. Maybe I can get some more magic lenses when I get to Welgaia, because that is where we are going. We are gonna go to Welgaia after after this area. That's not really a spoiler. Welgaia, as you saw way back when, it was up in the up in the stars and everything, so... Yeah, well, Gaia is part of oh, Darius Carlon. It is the city of Darius Carlon. But before we get there, we obviously have to find out how to get there. And we need to find all the treasure. There's still four chests to be found somewhere. Um, now where is it? I think it's, I think we're going north. Or northeast, kinda, but I'm just gonna call it north. North, north, north. That sounds so weird. Hello, there I be a chest. Thank you very much. With a magical ribbon. A ribbon with strong magical power. Is that the best ribbon in the game? I actually think it is. So you know what? Who shall have a magical ribbon? You know what, Range, is because you're so magical. Here you go. Have yourself a ribbon. A very beautiful blue ribbon. And now we shall go the other way. South. I'm... There's not really much to say around here, really. We're just walking and walking and walking. Some new enemies here and there. Nothing really special. It's a bit sad, actually. I'm sure there could be done some something more with this place. And there's nothing down here, apparently. Hm. Oh well, guess we're going back. I don't know where we're going then. Hmm. Oh well. Just gonna head back. Somehow. Somewhere. I don't know where. Hmm. But yeah. There is Carlon. It looks a bit creepy, but it's not really. I don't really have much to say to this area. We just... I don't know. It is a kind of a boring area. It's not like... There's anything really unique. Well, like, there's something unique about it, but there's nothing, nothing special about it. It's just a tiny little area with nothing in it. Unlike going to a dungeon and there are puzzles to be done or something like that. It's just kind of meh. Aha! I'm really good with the sorcerer's ring today. My goodness! I do need some practice with the sorcerer's ring so I can use it at its max efficiency. Why do I need to do this? You'll find out some other time. And here is an next level 4 that I do not care about anymore. Yeah, I kind of... I kind of forced that one. That was kind of intentional. That wasn't something I did. Not on purpose. Oh dear, I missed. That's not a good thing. And right up here is nothing. Okay, it's further on than I guess. So we're up at five chests now. Yeah, just two more to go. But yeah, right up here, I believe, is the exit right there. But we're not going to go there right now. We shall go this way and get more treasure. If we can find it, that is. Hello there. Oh, there's the treasure and some enemies trying to kill me. And here we have x level 4 yet again. And... This is gonna be a piece of cake. Oh dear, it's a dark archer! Oh no, more enemies and... Yeah, I don't have my magic lenses, so I can't do anything about that. And you should stop casting the goddammit. Ow, 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 evil, evil ice tornado. I'm gonna give you some ice. Ice and fire, a song of ice and fire. No, a blade of ice and fire. That's what we have here. The hell happened to the hilts? The hilts have gone black. What the hell? What is this magic? Fool, get the stone. Okay. Um, kind of a glitch, I think, or something. Oh well, whatever. Moving right along. We still have one chest to find. And it should be this way, somewhere. Silly enemies getting in my way. Why do you try to prolong this strange visit of ours to Darius Carlon? Even though 
When we do move onward, we're still gonna be in Deris Carlon, just not the area known as Deris Carlon. And I think actually if we continue going this way, eventually we would get back to the beginning. And there's an extreme level 3 that I do not care about at all. But yeah, we, we don't want to go back to the beginning, no! We want to go back to that circle thing so we can move forward and save Sheena and then take out Mythos. Or you, Drasil. There was something about him not liking people calling him Mythos unless they were his old companions. So I guess we're not allowed to call him Mythos. We have to call him you, Drasil. Hm. Oh my. Actually, just because of that, we should call him Mythos. Just to piss him off even more. Ha ha ha. What the? Oh no, it's a trap! Lloyd, I'm sorry. It looks like I'm gonna trouble you again. <gasps> Lloyd, help us! <gasps> Forget about us. Find a way to evade this trap. <gasps> I see. So this is the... Lloyd! Get the Daris emblem! With it you can... <gasps> This device is not life-threatening. Please, don't worry. Lloyd, as long as you're all right, we still haven't lost. You must get to the Great Seed. Guys! Damn! What the hell is going on? What happened to everyone? Everything is all right. I can feel the presence of your companions. They are somewhere in this city. All right. Let's go find them. Well, Prosea, sure that this device isn't life-threatening, but... Who knows what's on the other side? Maybe that's life-threatening and I don't like that, so now we're all alone yet again. And we can't go this way. Yeah, we have to go look for everyone right over here! Behold the power of warping! Hello! Anyone up here? Sheena! Mythos! Get out of me now! Sheena! Ugh. She's too strong! I can't... Mythos! Get away from her! How dare you, human! You son of Kratos! How dare you give me orders! What's going on? Martell! How could you? Human, your kind must not be allowed to live. How far are you willing to go to take control of the mana? I'll never forgive you. You humans are all the same. What's going on? Mythos, Ewan, Dad. Lloyd, this is just a part of Mythos's memory. Don't be tricked. Why do you interfere? We both want the same thing! I just wanted to save the world and my sister! To have a world where no one will be persecuted! Sheena! Are you okay? Lloyd... I'm sorry for making you worry. You dork! The only thing that matters is that you're safe! <laughs> I'm glad to see you're safe too. It's because of you. Thanks. What? Uh, no, no. You don't need to thank me. I just... I just wanted to do that, that's all. Anyway, where's everybody else? They got caught in a trap, and we all wound up separated. Oh no! We have to hurry and find them! But you've still got Mythos's crystal attached to you. Yeah, but I'll be fine. We need to find the others right now. Alright. Yay! We got Sheena back! And the four skits! My goodness! I'm thinking there's a, there's a skit like this for basically everyone else as well. So, if it was Khaled, then it would be Welcome Back Khaled, etc, etc. And... I believe there's a certain something that if you have, with that character, or any character actually, if you have 2,000 affection or higher with any character, then this scene will happen right now. If you don't, then it'll happen after you free everyone else in Wilkaya, where we're about to go. So, that is a certain something. Not really. It doesn't change much, but there you go. 
it's a certain thing that happens. Yeah, Mythos is not inside Sheena anymore, thank freaking goodness. I will not stand for it! Also, you were so embarrassed, and it was cute. Yay! Oh, why wasn't there the, um, the, um, the, the image of her blushing? That would have been so very fitting. And just because the others had some slight costume changes, so there you go. Queen of the beach, let's move forward. The hell with those red sword things. Yep, welcome back to Elgaia and Queen of the Beach. Hmm, it, it does look very empty right now. All right then, moving on, and we need to go and find everyone. So, where should we go first? I think we'll go this way. We shall go down to where we found the, uh, the thing and apocalypse and all that stuff. Where the heck is this funky place? Huh? What's that strange noise? Strange noise? We're going to be swallowed up by the magic circle! Oh crap, let's get the hell out of here! Ow! What is this? What's that thing down there? What's the matter? You'll be caught unless you hurry and run. Such a pathetic sight, Zelos. Why is Remy all... It's gotta be an illusion. There's no way those two would be here. You're so stupid. You've shut your eyes to reality for so long that you can't even tell what's real anymore. Despite receiving your angelic powers, you still fail to realize that I am not an illusion. You are indeed a failure. It's so sad. How did someone so unworthy become the Chosen? It's no wonder he betrayed his friends. You two Chosens were born by mistake. Had you not been born, all these misfortunes would not have fallen upon everyone. You poor, poor Chosen, who will destroy the world. I've never brought mis... Never brought misfortune upon anyone? Really? Countless lives were lost because you valued your own life more than theirs. A Chosen who betrayed his friends and then came shamelessly back, and a Chosen who will destroy the world. A fitting end. Now, run away if you can. Be devoured by darkness and die. Damn it, we're gonna be eaten by that monster unless we do something. No! Would you like me to save you, Zelos? Beg for our forgiveness. And pledge loyalty to Crucius. That monster will bestow eternal suffering upon you. If it devours you, you will neither live nor die. You will be trapped in true darkness, tormented in isolation forever. Forever? I can save you. Join us and defeat Lloyd. Then it will all be over. Lord Mythos will reunite the worlds if you become the Goddess Martell. And he'll remove the title and duties of the Chosen from you, and transfer everything to me. Celeste will gain the power of the Chosen. Yes! What I've wanted more than anything else. The power of the Chosen. You'll let me have it, won't you? Just imagine, your life will finally have meaning and value. All you have to do is pledge your allegiance to me. As soon as you do that, you will be saved from the Shadow's grasp. The world will be saved? Celeste will become the Chosen. Listen to me, both of you. I've come for you guys. I'm right down below. Whoa, whoa, whoa! The only thing down there is that monster. Lloyd! Don't tell me you were eaten by that big thing! That Lloyd is the real illusion. The monster is mimicking his voice to lure you. I'm not an illusion. 
Did Martell want to possess your body? Do you think it's okay for Celis to become the next Chosen who could be sacrificed at any time? I... Well... Both of you have to decide for yourselves. But I have faith in you. I know you won't run away, even if what we're trying to do is difficult. Don't forget, your lives have value just by being alive and being there. Value in... just being alive? A traitor like me has value? Of course not. No life has any value just by being alive. Shut up. There's a significance in being born. But if that's not good enough for you, I'll give them another value. They're both valuable because they're my friends. Eh, that's a pretty pathetic value. But I suppose it'll do. You reject my offer? You know what I wish for, yet you still interfere? Sorry, but I got no choice. The guy who decided my value believes in me and tells me not to run away. I trust you, Lloyd. I, the sort of valuable Zelos, am headed your way. Aw, he beat me to it. Are you running away again? The world will end because of you. I won't run. We're going to reunite the world our way. Lloyd taught me that it's wrong to think that dying will solve everything. a failure as a Chosen, but I have to fulfill my duties as a Chosen by continuing to live. Welcome back, you two. Thanks, Lloyd. I'm not going to run away from life anymore. I'm going to live and find a new world with everyone. Exactly. Especially since we now have our newfound pathetic value and all. I'm going to try and face my challenges head on. Yeah, running won't solve anything. What possible value does one burden to exist with cursed blood have? Sometimes running's the only way to save yourself. Humans are... so arrogant. What is that? A spider figurine. But it's broken in half. Maybe it's an admonition to not run away. I guess that's one way to look at it. It might be true. I'm going to keep it as a reminder. And we get the spider figurine. I'm not so sure that's amazing or not, but whatever. Now we have that. And these scenes, these rescue scenes, obviously, depending on who gets kidnapped or taken over by Mythos, these scenes will change, and I know for a fact Sheena and Kratos are... they prefer showing up here, but I don't know about anyone else considering like if I... if you choose someone like Rain or Genus, who obviously doesn't show up here at this point, I don't know who would take their place. I don't really know, but maybe someone knows, and if someone knows, do tell us in the comments, because then we can learn some new things. And where do I want to go now? I think I want to go this way. I want to go back up here. Also, right there at the beginning, with the, um, with the whole calling out to Lloyd, it said Sheena, but that was Colette's voice. Not sure what happened there, but whatever, it's cool. And there were two other things that I kind of wanted to mention, and it was something about... Alright, Mythos, when he said... You son of Kratos. There, there, was, there was a space missing in that one. So it's like, what? He actually said, you son of Kratos. Or something like that. Silly spelling things. And I'm fully restored. Oh, I guess that was not what I really wanted. I wanted to find a vending machine. Maybe that is right over here? Maybe. Is this the vending machine? No. Then where's the vending machine? Is it over here somewhere? I can't remember. Somewhere. I hope it's somewhere. I really want my magic lenses. Give me magic lenses, damn it. Is this the vending machine? Those are pills. Yeah, there we go. Half magic lenses, please. Thank you. Thank you very much. Also, 
one thing I didn't mention either in the last episode was that Tabitha apparently learned how to speak? Apparently rocks falling down on your head and saving Mythos from getting crushed and everything apparently gave her a voice. Or a proper voice, not like I am like a robot of some kind. But yeah, that was a little weird, but hmm, whatever. And is it just me? Is it just me or did Tabitha's voice sound familiar in some way? I don't know. But right down there, we can see rain! But sadly, I think because of all the cutscenes and how long they are, we'll we'll have to wait until the next episode to save Rain, Genus, Regal, and Prosea, wherever they might be lurking these days. So, thank you very much for watching, and until next time, see you later.